Hi, I would like to ask your permission to use this video for educational purpose and on the internet. Would that be all right? Okay. Okay. Now, tell me about your pain. My pain gets so intense, there's days I just feel like I want to give up. And it feels like people just don't want to help me. And I've gone to different places and and they say, keep trying this, keep trying this. And it doesn't, none of it really helps. How long has it been going on? It's actually started, the main part started in, in 2020. Mm -hmm. And, but I had some earlier in life, but I was able to handle it. It wasn't this, nearly this bad. And it's actually about three or four days after I did physical therapy for about two months, I crashed. I yeah. literally crashed. I went down on my knees and I was, mm -hmm. I, the pain was so intense. Yeah. Now, your pain it as well goes down your leg, right? right? And uh, the, you're telling me that you got a surgery without calling any names. Tell me, what was that surgery about? How did it go? And where are we with that result of that surgery? Tell me about it. Well, they had a lumbar lam laminectomy. Yeah, the, here. This is, S1. yeah, this is it is. They took the back of the bone off. Yeah. By the way, I see here, this bone is literally grinding the bone. And like two pieces of bone that are broken grinding each other mm -hmm. you do not have to convince me you're in pain yeah. but some of my colleague look at that and they say there's nothing to be done there but i do believe we can help you okay okay so but tell me you got that laminectomy yeah. or decompression yeah. how did that go tell me about it well it did not go greatly because when i got up i had no feeling whatsoever in my feet Mm -hmm. And of course, they made me walk. When I did walk, I just kind of shuffled my feet along. But the but the third day, I had fluid build up in my right foot, it swelled mm -hmm. up. So you stayed three days in the hospital. Well, I did more. I actually, went wound up a week. Week in the hospital because okay. they took me down for an MRI, and there was fluid around the surgical bedside, and so yeah. they had to go back in. So, so they had, had to, to go back in. That another surgery. surgery. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and, you know, so wound up being in longer, and. And it was just like, and then I did not even see the surgeon after. He just sent me to somewhere else, and that was it. Yeah, I, but I it didn't no, help you? No, no, no help whatsoever. Okay, and now this was how many years ago? 2021. 2021. So In June of 2021. So more than two years you are living with this pain. I have not had been pain-free since. And, and, and you go to places, and nobody can give you an answer. Nobody yeah. can give you an option. They gave me, um, I tried physical therapy afterwards. I tried, they gave me traction. They gave me, what the thing was it? Um, they call it dry, dry maybe something kind of yeah, tried to get yeah. the nerves. And there was one other thing. I've had steroid injections. I'd had one, two, three, four, five of them that they didn't help a whole lot. Now living with this severe pain mess people up. Yes, they do. And can you tell me what does to your mental health to be in this pain all the time and everybody tells you can they cannot help you? Can you tell me how it feels? Do you well, want to share it? Well, I try to be up as much as I can and then try to be trying to be helpful, trying to do. But the pain creates things in your head that are I call it I go on the dark side because I feel like I just how much longer can I go on? I've had lack of sleep. I know my blood pressure has gone high. Um, yeah, and I just, I, I just, and then even though my husband says you're not useless, but I feel useless because of the pain, yeah. and I we, it has limited things I want to do in life. Yeah. Well, number one, it's not in your head; it yeah. is in your back. I see that. Mm -hmm. Number two, I think I can help you. Thank you. Okay. Because I you're an answer of prayer. I think I can help you. Mm -hmm. Let me do my homework. Okay. We are not going to jump to surgery, but. I can help you. Okay. okay, just let me do my homework, yeah. okay? Yeah. Well, thank you so much sharing this with okay. us, okay? I appreciate